All right, guys, Gary Dean, Infinity Custom Works. Today's a very special day because I got the opportunity, well, I took the opportunity to do some testing on the, the best version of what I did call last year Infinity Marine because this is, we, we had Infinity Auto and Infinity Marine. We've now gone to one product, just Infinity Marine. That is not going to be the name of the product, but that's how you can reference it from the past. <sighs> Guys. So I have a 99 Blazer. It's actually in my shop right now. I'm working on it a little bit, but I bought that Blazer to flip it and then I fell in love with it. So now I'm just fixing it up a little bit. Anyway, it has an aftermarket hood on it that's got a bunch of de defects and stuff, and I just didn't love it. So I went to a junkyard a few months ago, and I picked up a hood, a stock hood for this thing. And I'm probably going, well, now I've changed everything. I'm not going to do what I was going to do. This is no, that is no longer the plan. Not that you know what the plan is or the new plan or any of the plans, but I'm about to tell you what's going on. So... I basically scrapped painting it in the factory white color because I'm going to do a full-blown chameleon paint job on the blazer. Now, I've been testing out the newest version of uh, Infinity Marine, and I've got my boat behind me. Let me show you that. So I'm actually stripping off. I was testing a few things, but I'm right now I'm stripping off all of the old Infinity Marine that has been on here for two years. You can see I kind of caked it on this side. It's all orange peely and saggy. I just over applied it, but uh, the point is it worked really well. You couldn't tell that this thing had been in the weather, that it lives outside or nothing um, with the older version of Infinity Marine. Now the newest version is way better, way easier to use, but still recommended as a spray. Before I show it to you, I want to tell you that I added some color shift pearl pigment to it and I sprayed it just clear. So I added the pearl pigment and it works phenomenally. So you'll see how this all unfolds in the next few weeks because this is literally the future of my new company, Infinity uh, Custom Works. So um, I'm going to show you the hood now but I did the color shift on one side of the hood and then I just cleared over the whole thing with two coats of the Infinity Marine. So with that said, let me show you what's going on. So I did the color shift pearl. This is in the Infinity Marine product. All I did was mix it. So this product will mix 50-50 with acetone. So one to one with acetone as the reducer. This is just pigment. I did not paint this at all. This has two layers. Yes, it has trash in it. I just did it right over there, outside. But look how awesome it laid down. Super flat. Oh, you can see it does have some of the uh, pearl in it just because I didn't clean the gun real well before I went and sprayed it. But look at that, how well and flat it laid down. And this is, this was just like the base coat minus the clear because apparently it had all like just gone bad and flaked off or whatever. And you'll see, I'm sure you saw in the picture, but this right here is just the blue green, uh, the mystic blue green color shift. From this angle, it's blue. Well, you can't see it from here. It does get green. <laughs> it's blue and green. But my point is, Oh my gosh, it came out so good. Now, the biggest winner here with the Infinity Marine product. Again, that is not the official name. That is the name that you are probably most familiar with. But the benefit to this stuff 
is if you if you if you have us do a custom job like this on any color i can tint this clear any any color i can also add pearls color shift pearls metallic big metal flake small metal flake all of that and look at that no wet sanding no buffing no orange peel period it worked out perfect i am going to do my whole boat with it but I just want to show you guys what's going on. I sprayed this with Infinity Marine. That is my clear, guys. That is a clear coat and ceramic coating in one. And again, that's not paint. That is color shift pearl pigment in Infinity Marine. I can do that to this as well and make it have that color flip. I might even do that. I'm, I'm over the moon, guys. This, this product is going to be awesome. Imagine taking your car to get a wrap done, okay? They're using razor blades all around your car, potentially scratching it all up. Then you got to have them pull the wrap off the car, okay? That's dangerous on your paint. This right here removes with acetone or xylene, if you want to use xylene. You reduce it with acetone. You can remove it with acetone or xylene. But look at that gloss. Gloss is awesome. This is the future right here. Oh, and you can't see any defects in that. This actually repairs everything as you lay it down. The only problem with it is you can't hand apply it. It just won't self-level. We just can't make it self-level enough where you can't tell you didn't spray it and that doesn't make me happy the other thing is this is way faster yes you've got more setup time yes you've got more uh, effort you've got to put in and all the things to get things ready and clean up and all of that but you get a superior result guys don't be afraid to spray again this is just two light coat two light coats of uh, just the infinity marine product over here on top of all i did was wipe it down with alcohol there will be a prep shampoo and a prep prep wipe should you choose one or the other um, but i wiped it down with isopropyl alcohol that's it and then i sprayed the future is looking bright guys um i will be doing this same process not the same thing i'm going to do a, a green and purple color shift on my s10 i actually got it all prepped up i got all the vinyl decals off this stupid pinstripe that was on it now i just gotta tape it up prep it tape it up and then uh, i can spray it but today was test day and the tests went phenomenally guys phenomenally if you guys got a question for me let me know uh, but this right here is the future of infinity custom works for sure um, especially the marine this is crazy durable stuff this has been on here for two years back here and it looks as fresh as the day I did it um, I have been testing a few other things like on this side that's a new product that's a new product you can see how well they work as far as bringing back the gloss but this side um, I actually color sanded and polished it all and I actually cut too deep. And as you can see, the water discolored the gel coat because I cut all the good stuff off like an idiot. All right, guys, if you got questions for me, send me a message, let me know what's going on. But this looks awesome. I am so excited. I'm so excited. Whew. If you've got a great idea for a name for this product, let me know. But it has to be fantastic. That's where I'm at. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Check out DetailJuice.com for all your product needs. Uh, remember, March 1st every year is the new product release day. So uh, in just a few short weeks, we'll be releasing everything for 2023, including this product. This product will be on the website for sale. And I'll have tons more videos of it. 
But thanks for watching, guys, and have a wonderful day. I'm super stoked, as you can probably tell. Thanks again, guys, for watching. All right, I was about ready to pack up for the day, and then I decided it wasn't as glossy as I wanted it to be. So I just put another coat of the clear right on top, and now look at it. Stupid gloss. Uh, and I didn't have to scuff it. I didn't have to do none of that. All I did was wipe it down with a tack cloth and spray another coat. Um, and I'm sure I mentioned that in the first segment. That's not paint. All that is is pearl pigment that I added to the clear. Look at that coverage. This panel looked all like that, but flat and nasty. All right, I'm gonna walk around it 9,000 more times, but you see the gloss. You see how the green and then it shifts into blue? Super sweet. All right, guys, that's it. I just wanted to show you I wasn't done. <laughs> I never am. Thanks, guys.